Welcome to Lancaster County, everyone. Aaron and Justice Buggy Ride started uh, with a simple idea, a little girl and her horse. And of course, Jessica was my daughter. And uh, that was 30 years ago. We've been giving carriage rides ever since. I think that many folks that come to Lancaster County often tell us that uh, it's the highlight of their visit. I think that's because it's uh, for real. Our brethren, Amish, Mennonite, drivers, you know, take you to our own home farm. So when, so when you ride with us, you're not going to a, a commercial property that's set up uh, to be some kind of farm. It's uh, a real tour of a real working Amish farm. I don't think that others others come close to offering folks what we do. When you ride with us, we offer several different routes, and again, it's all through Amish Farm Country. With some of our routes, we take you right in the middle of, of Amish Farms, and others we go to the farm, we stop and get off. You can tour the house and the barn. You can get cookies and you can get uh, drinks, all homemade. I like that. One of the things you also you can do is um, is ask for a custom ride where we go for longer rides and, and visit the farms or visit a, a Waterhard flour mill or Amish stores, two stores in a farm. There's lots, there's lots of things you can do that uh, all you have to do is ask the nice Mennonite man who signs you up or one of the girls who signs you up. Young folks, I like what you said about how people came here. You know, uh, when the English took over from, from the Dutch, uh, the English realized they had a problem. England was very small, France and Spain were very large, so they had to do something. They didn't even have enough people to populate this place. And uh, the English kings, by and large, had married German ladies. So they said to themselves, I know, we'll invite the relatives to come. The, they invited their allies, and of course the map of Europe wasn't the same then. Holland was much bigger. Our people, when they came here, our particular part of our family came from some part of Holland, which is which is Belgium now. And uh, they they decided they had they had to do something, so they they invited people to come from Germanic realms. And uh, why they they came from Latvia, Estonia, Lithuania, Poland, Prussia, Russia. Czechoslovakia, you know, Bohemia, Moravia, parts of Hungary, Austria, Transylvania, over through the Falls, Westphalia, up into, still from Alsace, Belgium. They filled the country up with German-speaking people, so by the time of the American Revolution in 1776, only 17% of the country was English, 62% was German, and the other 20% were some French, some Czechs, Poles, and other nationalities. Like this. <laughs> just got to hope they don't stop. So as I said earlier, you can visit a farm or a flour mill. You can just go for a ride through the country, go to an Amherst store. None of our rides are expensive. They're all family prizes. 